Another way to view a plot is to use ISO clipping. This type of clipping allows you to isolate a value or a range of values. To activate ISO clipping, I'll right click on a plot, stress 1 in this case, and select ISO clipping. This brings up the ISO clipping property manager. What I'd like to do is display only the values above 300 megapascals. Notice I can't change the units here. These units are the same as those used for the stress plot itself. If I briefly cancel out of the ISO clipping property manager, I can edit the definition of the stress 1 plot and change to megapascals. Now I can once again access the ISO clipping property manager and type in 300 with the units already set to megapascals. If I instead wanted to isolate stress values below 300 megapascals, I simply click the reverse direction button. This can be very useful when you're trying to minimize weight or decrease the amount of material used. By isolating regions of very low stress, you can learn where material can be eliminated without affecting the structural integrity of the part. In addition to isolating values above or below a single value, I can enable the ISO2 option and specify a second value to establish a range. Here, for instance, I'll type in 375 megapascals. Now all values between 300 and 375 megapascals are shown. The legend also indicates the upper and lower limits of this clipping, making it easier to see how my range relates to the yield strength of the material. As with section clipping, I can continue to add as many ISO values as I wish to further isolate specific stress values. Once I click OK, the stress plot will only show the isolated values. Since we're looking at values between 300 and 375 megapascals, I can modify my legend to provide better visualization of these stress levels. By default, Cosmos Works adjusts the legend to go from the minimum stress to the maximum stress. I want to adjust this scale to go from 300 to 375 megapascals. To do this, I'll right click the Stress 1 plot and select Chart Options. Here, I can control the appearance of the chart, including the range to be displayed. I'll change the automatic setting to Defined and type in 300 megapascals for the minimum and 375 for the maximum. There's quite a bit you can specify about the chart, including its position on the screen, whether you wish to have values displayed in scientific notation, the number of significant digits to display, and even the colors to be used in the spectrum. Now, the stress region is shown across a broad spectrum of colors, making it more informative than the earlier plot where I was only seeing two colors. To retrieve the entire plot, right-click the Stress 1 plot in the Cosmos Works Manager, select ISO Clipping, and at the bottom of the ISO Property Manager, click the Toggle button to disable the ISO plot. When I click OK, the full von Mises stress plot returns.